need some music. ancient and it's a proverb and it would certainly be the case here. While it's true that I'm a writer, what with this being my fifth published book thus far, I'm first and foremost a record producer. And that means a lot of things to a lot of people. Most of them wrong. The business has been tough in the last eight years and the toll of operating in the red since the crash of 2008 has left me somewhat behind. Mixerman, my name is Panir Kanish. A slick webzine splashed my screen. Panier was indeed a billionaire. Happy days! It is urgent that I speak to you about an opportunity to mentor my son to become the world-famous producer of Bollywood music. Bollywood music? My son can learn everything he must by being at your service for one year, as you are paid for the pleasure of his company. And you get a story, too. This is a gift that I give to you. I am Raja Dut. I am here to take care of security. What are we protecting? The entitled child of a billionaire. What do you think we are protecting? Hey, 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 it's a beautiful day in Los Angeles. Kanesh? Who else? Kanesh exuded charisma that was about a million times more charming than his father. Are you taking me to your studio? I have been dreaming for weeks of the moment that I would first enter your room. Kanish stood up abruptly and walked towards the front of the house where the Bentley was parked. I will send my driver and chef away. Wait, did you say chef? These were not glorified mall cops. These were Sikhs, martial arts experts from India. As if on cue, Sikh number four breezed into the kitchen and began washing the dishes with great aplomb. Maybe we should take a road trip. A road trip? A line of ten cars was now crawling up the mountain, a silver Prius leading the parade. I'm not sure what it is about Prius drivers, but for some reason, they seem content to be the ones in this world who constantly fuck up the free flow of traffic. Prius drivers are such fucking douchebags. You think you're going to get the far side to perform this douchebag song? Why not? You see? You're music mogul material. It was the Rev. Mixer Man. That's very interesting. So, how does one become a music mogul? I gotta get me one of them billionaire heirs. Willie Show, the former super producer, is currently the president of Easter Island Records. Well, tell me about the douchebag song then, Kanish. It sounds fascinating. I could do much better than that. I can play and sing it for you. You can? I'd so love to hear it. That's $50,000 to get you boys started. My favorite news commentator, Rochelle Meadows. This is Senator Crudita, and as you probably know, he's running for president. Senator Crudita, of all people, was sitting next to me. You realize I think you're a total douchebag, right? If half the people don't hate you, you're doing something wrong. But aren't we supposed to be hiding the fact that we have billionaires? It depends on what you're trying to achieve. If you want everyone to know you're a force to be reckoned with, then you flaunt your billionaire. Huh. Mixie, Mixie, wake up. Your sidekick is here. Aardvark? I had indeed manifested Aardvark. It's pretty clear to me what's going on here. Mm, what's that? What you need is a manager. We should go to some club tonight. Clubs? What clubs? To the fucking knack. I don't know. Hip-hop clubs? What up, yo? I'm MC Skanky. Oh, you the chaperone? Yo, what up, Skanky? You better get in there. You bought up. The music jumped dramatically in volume and clarity the moment the ultra-heavy metal door swung open. This is Mukesh, everyone. We were dorm mates at Eden. Hello. Mukesh said unenthusiastically with a wave. GQ was now ringing the Skype. Oh, yeah. GQ. Swami GQ. Oh, yeah. Whoa. 
You're a DJ producer too? How crazy is that? His name is Kaisa Pesa. It roughly means cash money. Rub all of him, girls. Rub her like the sexy beast that he is. Sexy beast would not be the term that I would use to describe GQ. Lakshmi, the attractive Limeyer. And how much are we paying for this exactly? The same rate that everyone else pays for our services. Take as much as you possibly can. The Empress walked us down the stairs to the lower level of her hillside home. Are you a feminist? Ha! Of course I'm a feminist. What kind of an idiot would I be not to be a feminist? Let's go do headlines. We're here at the House of Mixer Man, as some have called it. It's a pleasant house in what used to be a quiet neighborhood near the beach. Big question on everyone's mind. Where is Mixer Man? Mr. The Rev, are you in cahoots with Mixer Man? Is there collusion going on here? What? No, it's all Mixer Man. He's the one that started this whole thing. Mixer Man is the culprit. Mixer Man is the mastermind. Our musical system has been so corrupted by billionaires' heirs, they've cornered the market with their views and they've diluted the people's shares, and damn it, that's not what America is about. What do you have to say for yourself, Mixer Man? How are you going to fix this? Why you gotta be like that? That's the Just question. Another douchebag, another douchebag, another douchebag. Driving in your Prius, yeah, you know you see us. How you gonna beat us when you driving in the Prius? Just another douchebag, another douchebag. in the pool.